Hey everyone, it's Chrissy from Stitch Collective, and in this video I'm going to talk about how I shop for thread online. Um, I find this more economical and cost effective, and I think it's especially useful right now during quarantine when you can't necessarily buy your thread in person in the store. And what do I mean by it's more economical and cost effective? Um, so this is thread that I bought using the method that I'm going to talk about. Uh, and this is thread that I bought at Joanne. So this is 100 meters and this is 1,000 meters and they cost the same. So this was $3 and this was $3. Um, so the first method that I'm going to talk about is using a shade card or a color book. And what this is is essentially just a book and it has all the different colors in this instance of Guterman thread, so that's the thread color that they have at Joanne and most retail sewing stores in the US. Um, but it's all of their colors essentially of their weight of thread that would be good for sewing most garments. Um, so I love this book, uh, number one, because I can see all the colors all at once. It's really compact, it's easy to use. Um, and it's easy to use because all of the shade cards themselves come out of the book and they're also made of actual thread. So that's really great when you have say your fabric they're actually going to make your project out of and then you can take the two or three cards that match most closely you know lay them on top and then you can take this and walk around that you can go inside or outside and just look in different lights to see which color matches the best and then the thing to note about this process is that the color numbers for this um, color chart and then what you would find in joanne are actually different color numbers even though they're the same brand of thread, which I think is dumb that they have different color numbers, uh, but it is what it is. And you can easily uh, match your color number. And I'm gonna talk about that in a second. And so for instance, this uh, that I bought at Joanne again, this is number 911. And so this is what's called their retail numbering system. And then this is called, again, it's Guterman brand, um, but it's called Mara thread, M-A-R-A. -A, and that's just like their wholesale thread that they sell in like larger quantities, say for like designers or like factories that are buying huge quantities of thread. That brand of Guterman is called the Mara, essentially uh, like thread series. And you can actually see it here on the color, the shade card, Guterman Mara. And so one thing to note about the shade card is you do need to purchase it. I'll put a link below, uh, but I got this from Wawak Sewing in the US. You can also get it from Cleaner Supply, which I think is the same company, just they have different names for US versus Canada. Um, but this was about 20 or $25. I bought this maybe six or seven years ago and I use it all the time. So I think it was definitely worth the price, especially just in terms of the cost savings of the size of the thread, because I can get six or seven projects out of this, whereas I can maybe get one, maybe not, out of the 100 meter spool of thread. And so the thing that you can do that maybe you're not ready to invest in buying the shade card is you can still buy the big spools of thread using this technique. And what it is, is essentially using a mapping. And so this that I'm looking at right here, this sheet is essentially a, um, a color number chart that's mapping the Joanne or the retail color number to the Mara, which is called the wholesale color number. And again, it's wholesale because like fashion designers or um, like factories would be buying these, I mean, even bigger quantities than on this spool. Um, but it's really easy to use. So all you would need to do is see the color number on the end of your Joanne spool, say if you were already in the store before and you color match the thread, um, but you just wanna buy more of it, or if you're in the thread, sorry, in the store right now and you can pick out the color in the retail store, you can take a picture of the end of the spool and then you can go online to Wawak or you know whatever uh, website sells the Guterman Mara and then use the color number from this chart to order the big spool. And then one last option that you can do is you can actually call Cleaner Supply or Wawak, or if you're in Europe, there are gonna be other retailers that sell these size of the Mara spools, and they should be able to tell you if you have the retail color number, what the Mara color number is. So again, I use this technique all the time. I've used it for almost a decade. I've been really useful. Hopefully you guys found this useful as well. And if you did, I'd love if you comment below on which method you think you'll use. Um, if you also post about it on Instagram, I'd love if you tag me because I'd love to see it. Thanks, you guys.